Yo, what's good, guys? Your boy Steve from Trip Gaming. Uh, today's video, we're gonna be doing uh, my DDD combo tutorial. I will show you we end on Siegfried Dragster. It's five in the gate, Siegfried Dragster, Firewall Griffin. We're gonna add a jackal on top uh, with, of a random hand with DDs. It was on Sam's channel earlier. We're gonna show you now how to do it on this channel. Uh, one thing to note as well, if you guys are gonna buy anything from Amazon, use my link in the description below, okay? Uh, support your boy. If you buy anything, I just get a little commission from it. So if you buy anything from Amazon, use that link below. And also check out my Patreon, guys. I make any deck you guys want sick. I'm gonna go right into the, the profile, but before we do that, uh, man, too many too many of you guys don't lift enough. Uh, remember my old fitness channel, Trip Fitness. Uh, I'm gonna put that to the side for now. I'm gonna be talking a little about fitness uh, on this channel just to make sure you guys uh, get it done. So uh, today we got chess. It's our one week. Uh, it's our one week uh, transformation so far. Uh, we're getting some gains from it, you know, one weekend. Some gains, not too much, but we're getting there, man. One weekend. Uh, we'll see how it is. We're going to go do chess right now. We're going to, even if you, man, if you, whether you lift or not, I don't care. I'm going to have a little bit of fitness in this channel. Uh, so we're going to go do chess right now. Uh, and I'll see you guys at the end of chess. And we're going to go right after chess today. We're going to do, we're going to go straight into the Yu Gi Oh! video. This is going to be the new. Uh, way I do these videos are gonna be mostly Yu-Gi-Oh, but a little bit of my life almost like a vlog But mainly Yu-Gi-Oh video. It's gonna be like 90% Yu-Gi-Oh, but uh, a little bit everything else too So uh, I want to show you guys to make money in the future too, even just short-term money like uber and stuff Just to get you guys a little more money because too many people that play Yu-Gi-Oh uh, Your money might not be right watching this like you might not be ripped uh, You might have you might not be doing so good in school, but there's so much more to life than Yu-Gi-Oh, man There's so much more so I don't want people that only play Yu-Gi-Oh! only care about games. I want you guys to focus about your future too. Whether you're 12 years old, 20 or 30, doesn't matter. 24, like me, don't matter. Like you got to focus on your life, man. You got to focus on your success. And you got to focus on getting places. Yu-Gi-Oh! is secondary. So uh, the new way the channel is going to be, man, just straight up. Uh, I'm going to be 90% uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! But then there's going to be a little aspect of it where it's fitness and success as well. So I'm going to show you guys my workout super quick for 30 seconds. And then we're going to go straight into Yu-Gi-Oh! video right after that. All right, yo, this is a small little clip of my workout. I already did my entire workout. This is a little bonus. If you look at the weight, I cannot do this weight whatsoever. I just want to show this to give you guys a little lesson. Last week, I did 45 on each side for 8 reps. I'm trying to hit 45, 25 on each side for 5 reps. I couldn't do it. So what's that mean? I tried again. I tried 3 whole sets of doing this. I couldn't do it. Uh, but I'm not defeated. You never lose. You only learn. So I learned from this. Next week, I'm going to do 45, five, uh, 5 reps. 45, 25 on each side, 5 reps. A huge uh, upgrade from last week. This is not my workout. This is a little clip. I already did my whole bench workout. But this is just to show you guys that don't give up because next week I'm going to hit 45 and 5 no matter what. There's no such thing as failure. It's only learning. Don't forget that. Little lesson. Let's go to the Yu-Gi-Oh! now. All right, guys. That was chest day. I'm feeling swole. Uh, we're going to go straight into Yu-Gi-Oh! video. Just going to be our DDD combo tutorial. It's on Sam's channel. Let's go. 5 negates, 6 negates, 7 negates. You already know. Any random hand. Let's go. All right, Steven. So basically what I'm doing right now is I'm shuffling your deck and you know for those haters Yeah, bro, basically the last video we did you all you guys hated just because I, I swore a little big deal I swore so we have to take it out because I don't want to be saying all these swear words on on, uh, on the channel Because you know, we gotta keep then, it like, for kids and stuff and then my channel will get demonetized Yeah, so we don't want to do that. So yeah, so you uh, know what no cuts nothing because Steven is the god of pendulums Steven man five card hand, right? But should I do two to make it fair? All right, I'm cutting the deck. All right, let's go. All right, Steven, draw, draw your hand. Okay, so... Okay, okay, so no. This is honestly too easy, okay? This is too easy. No. This is too easy, we're doing a new hand. No, 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 no. This is too easy. No, 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 just do it with his hand. Just, just do it with his hand? Okay, okay. So, all right. Like, yeah. This is too easy, but whatever, okay. Wait, wait, so how good is this hand, Steven? This hand is just like every other hand, broken. <laughs> like, it's, like, look at it, look at it. You play six ways to go into a Kepler, right? You drew one of them. You play 14 turbo cards. You drew two of them. This right, is Steven. useless, and you don't need this. Okay, These are both useless right now. This isn't even the best way to go into Kepler. It's actually not. This is actually a bad way to go into This is the worst way to go into Kepler. Because this is, you only get Kepler and get another contract. So that does nothing. This actually does nothing right now. So you actually only open two, uh, all you need is turbo cards. So turbo cards are going to get you what you actually need. 
So it's an above average hand because you drew the turbo cards, but you all you play 14. So why on earth won't so first step by you, step, step by yeah, step, step by step. You look at your hand, you have two turbo cards, so you got to use that to your advantage. So you're obviously going to draw two because you play 14 and 40. Uh, you're not playing 60, unfortunately, because all those 60 are just play 20 search cards, right? So you play 40, uh, so you don't get draw being card, but anyways, Cerberus activate. Get Jackal. If you're going second against uh, if you're going second against Trick Stars and you, you fear Joe Reincarnation, there's different ways to do this uh, where you don't need to search right away, but you can play it super, super slow and still win because they won't achieve anything. But you search Jackal. Uh, you could, if you want, you can special Chrono, special Jackal, and then stop them from stop yourself from getting hand trapped. But uh, this hand's so broken that it plays through hand traps, so don't even worry about that. Special Chrono, special the Dead Cerberus. Next, we go into Electro. Number one. Electrum effect. We're gonna send Wisdom Eye Magician. Wisdom Eye? Yes. Because we drew Hamster. If we didn't draw Hamster, we'd be sending a, a Kepler and start going into our DDs. But we have three Electrums to play with. We have three to play with. So the first one's gonna send Wisdom to ensure we have scales. Hamster's gonna normal, but the second one's gonna add back to Wisdom. The third one's gonna add the Kepler we need to, uh, to put up our combo. So we're gonna go Wisdom. Then we're gonna normal Hamster. Bring out two more Wisdoms. Like I said, the reason magicians are in the deck is for the scales. So what? That's why we play only one of each. So we get the wisdoms off, and uh, we have done. We have access to any scales we want. So you already normal. Yes. So hamster was a normal. We haven't used any of their effects yet, by the way. We just sent one and sent one. That's it. Okay. Now with the electrum, we're gonna send our first DD. Just so you guys understand the thought process here. There's a few plays you could do. You drew this, we could search, which could search anything. This is probably going to search Thomas, because Thomas is gonna, then going to search what we're going to add here. Mm. We can add any of these three. We're going to need this in our extra eventually, in order to put through the, the whole uh, combo with Siegfried. We're going to need uh, this to send a Lamia, or this to get a plus. So we have options here. I don't think we need Kepler, because we're going to be fine for pluses. So we're not going to send that. I think we're going to send Copernicus to ensure that... Uh, Oh, actually, Brain Blast, boys. We're sending a Leonidas. Leonidas, okay. Yes. Next, we're going to activate Contract. What are you searching off uh, Contract? And we are going to get Copernicus. We could get Thomas. Actually, maybe we'll get Thomas. Uh, yeah, we'll get, Tom we'll get Thomas. It's a big, better plus. We get Thomas, because Thomas will, will get back to Leonidas for free. Hi, my name's Thomas. <laughs> uh, Tom, Thomas get Leonidas, so it's a free plus. Here we could have got Kepler, or Copernicus has got a free more pluses. But uh, the last thing, we're going to send something else other than uh, Leonidas. So it's Leonidas has to be part of the combo, no matter what. You need it because of its name to ensure Siegfried comes out. It's a, a very important. So next, we're going to activate this Electrum effect. We haven't used any other effects yet. To pop the Leonidas, or sorry, to pop the Thomas to add a hamster. And then we're gonna draw one because we haven't draw yet, so we're gonna cut. Yeah. Doesn't matter what we draw here. It doesn't really matter what you draw. Does not matter. I would like it not to be a foolish burial card, but <laughs> it, it doesn't matter. We still the combo regardless. So Jackal. It didn't matter what we drew to be honest. Uh, next, we're gonna activate hamster and scale. That uh, two wisdom eyes. Oh, now, oh, and I just fix our seals. Yeah. So now our scales are gonna be two magicians. We're gonna save those. We're gonna get a few pluses as well. Uh, so now we're gonna activate. We're gonna want to save this. We're going to activate. Wait, did you activate this to get... Um... Yeah, so we activated this to get Thomas. Yes. So we got a free plus from that. Next, we're going to act we'll activate both uh, Wisdoms now. Just to get some pluses in. So Oath Dragon, Black Fang. <laughs> Don't add anything yet. Yeah, so we're, yeah, we're going to add now. Oath, add Wisdom. Next, Electro, we are going to pop, let's see here, we're going to pop Contract, add Chronograph, add Chrono, Special Chrono, and we're going to Special anything, we'll Special Jackal, we're going to, at the very end, the play is going to be, we're going to summon a Leonidas here, well, after our pen summon, we're going to summon a Jackal here, and two level fours to get time, uh, the other, the Toonie Magician, now, the way the hand was, was, was made, we could have sent Lamia, but we had access to two Wisdom Eyes. So when you have access to the Wisdom Hamster play, send two Wisdoms to get the Tuning Magician instead of Lamia. It's a better way to do the combo. 
if you don't, because opening uh, hamster wisdom without normal summoning is very rare. But when you do that, this is just a better plus, more plus way to do it to ensure Siegfried and uh, Dragster come up with the same Firewall Griffin board. It's a more plus way to do it. If you don't open one of those, because it's very rare to do, to be honest, uh, uh, we would have gone, we would have not popped this. We would have gone through a Copernicus instead, and it would have been the exact same result. So an Electrum effect. Here we have many plays we could do. Special, special. This will actually just be a free send. So you can send anything at this point. Yeah. Doesn't matter. Nope. Does not matter. Uh, for zero. At this point, you just want to do the most plus. It's not important what you send. It's almost just like a follow up for next time. We're just gonna send a dark worm. Uh, just because it really doesn't matter what we send. We open good enough where the third uh, send sometimes doesn't even matter. Uh, so now we might not even activate its effect. Uh, we can just fix our, our hand up a bit if we feel like it. But what we're gonna do is honestly, we're not even gonna activate the last electrum. That's how like we don't need to. We're gonna have the whole combo regardless. We actually don't need to use it whatsoever. So we're gonna link it away right here for firewall. In fact, what we're gonna do, we're not gonna activate the last electrum whatsoever. So remember how this is how the situation was? We're not gonna send the worm, we're literally just gonna go straight into firewall. We're gonna save an electrum. Sometimes your hand's good enough where you don't need to use the last electrum, and you save the last electrum in case they main deck sphere mode and they're, uh, okay. sure. they're uh, you know, they're a person I don't like. But anyways, <laughs> we're gonna pen summon. Wait, so how'd you go into firewall using electrum? Oh uh, yeah, so electrum and then uh, jackal and chronograph. Okay, okay, cool. So just, just four monsters like that, and we're gonna pen summon the jackal, the two wisdoms, and the Leonidas. This is why you had this in the Leonidas uh, to ensure we got the combo, and we're gonna time star. Time star effect. How, how are you summoning the tuning magician? Uh, with uh, the very broken needs to be bad firewall. So now tuning magician's effect. We can special summon it if we want because we have the two magicians, right? Oh, that's our effect. So you yeah, have two magicians yeah, scales. Yeah. But we could also do it if it's in the graveyard. Wow. Yeah. So I think it's best to just keep uh, wait a bit. So what we're gonna do now is this is where it gets a little interesting. We want to think how we want to do the combo. So I think the best play here would be. Electrum, yeah, so Electrum and Time Star. We're gonna link those into Metaltron. Well, we're gonna put this. Uh, yeah, because you're making Griffin, anyways, right? Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna put Metal. Hold on one sec. Yeah, we're gonna put it right here. Now, the effect of Firewall. We're gonna special the 2D Magician. Just one sec. We're gonna put the metal tron right here, okay? Then we're gonna special the wisdom eye, the dead wisdom eye we had. So and then we're gonna link into the Griffin, and then you activate firewall. Yeah. Oh, gr Griffin or Goblin? Oh, wrong, wrong one. We're gonna go Griffin, and if we wanted, we could discard the Jackal and to draw, but we're not gonna do that just yet. We're gonna, we're not gonna use it at all. Actually, we actually don't need to. We're gonna then special the Tuning Magician. A firewall dragon. So a firewall dragon, yes. Okay. And then we're gonna uh, synchro. To Siegfried. Into Siegfried. Uh, tri uh, triggering Firewall again. We're now gonna bring out Toonie Magician. Wow. Effect. <laughs> Yo, what the? Or right, this gets banished. And then this is your board. So it's actually even better than I told you guys. So, so, so how many negates is this? This is five negates. Uh, tr real, like, you got real, real interruptions here. Like, we're talking Siegfried. We're talking Dragster. Good luck playing Spells and Traps. Good luck playing monster effects, because you can't, because we got a nice floodgate in Griffin here. We got firewall to bounce your thing, and if you want to hand trap something, we're negating that too. You want to use the gear effect? No chance. You want to use spiral top? No chance. And you don't main sphere mode, because if it was game two or game three, we're going into a massacre strike, baby, with Beatrice. So that's, bro, I told you, this is broken. Uh, honestly, our, 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 we opened pretty, we opened good. Uh, it would have been the exact same board, except maybe not a Jackal. It's irrelevant. We won with just these four. And it would we have would have more cards in hand. Because the DDs would have led to more pluses. But you gotta look at the card at the deck you or the hand you have. You saw it. Yep. We had the we, we had one we had the bad way to get into a DD, the contract. Uh, but we still got ended up on the Siegfried. So the play is this. Uh, we could have it's just a, I don't want to explain it, man. It's just truly beautiful. It's truly beautiful. Uh, sometimes I look at it and just see myself smiling at how good of a player I am. But...
Good luck breaking this. All right, Steven. Thank you so much for watching this video, bro. Any uh, anything you want to say before we end off this like profile? Not yeah. Overall, this combo video. Yeah, bro. Two things. What? One. I told you guys in the last video, man. Too many of you guys are fat. Go follow my Trip Fitness YouTube channel. It's my new channel I made, man, to make sure that YouTube, uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh community in the world, uh, actually, we don't we get too much of a bad rep. I want you guys to lift too. I'm doing a transformation from skinny to shredded. I'm in my third day, uh, fourth day or something. Uh, I'm gonna get shredded, man. In three months from now, I'm gonna get absolutely shredded, and I hope it'll motivate some of you guys to, uh, to do it too. And lastly, there's only one reason I made this combo. Why? That's this beautiful mat I bought, bro. I got it from Sam. Uh, I don't even like Sky Strikers. I think the artwork is just too sick. I just look at these and I'm like, bro, I'm going to savage Sky Strikers using their mat. Okay. Okay, Steven. Thank you so much, brother, for, for your support, bro. Thank you. you. Guys, make sure you guys uh, go follow Trip uh, Fitness in the description box below and get your play mats today. They'll be absolutely amazing, guys. And Steven, all, all right. right. And one more thing. What's up? Follow Trip Gaming 2 for sick combos. Okay, no problem, guys. All right, this is Sam from Team Sarah Sam Sanya. I'll leave all the links in the description box below. All right, guys. Peace. Yo, I hope you guys like that combo, man. I hope you guys got a little motivation to go lift later. Because it's not just about Yu-Gi-Oh, man. It's about lifting, too, and about making some money. So I'm going to go make some money myself. going to go drive some Uber. And then, uh, guys, five negates. Easy. Play this list for Nats, man. You're going to win a lot of duels, man. You're going to win. If you don't misplay, you're going all the way to the top. Because I'm not going, man. You're going all the way to the top if I don't go. So check out the deck. Uh, it's an amazing deck. And if you haven't already, if you're going to buy anything from Amazon, guys... Use my link in the link. Later, guys. See you in the next video. Peace.